welcome back to Daybreak. I'm Leah Davis here with Entertainment. 90s group TLC returns with a new VH1 biofilm called Crazy Sexy Cool, The TLC Story. Along with the new album and plans for an upcoming tour, Rosanda Chili Thomas and Tion T-Boss Watkins made a comeback since rapper Lisa Left Eye Lopez died in a car crash in 2002. Actress du Drew Sedora plays T-Boss, rapper Little Mama portrays as Left Eye, and actress-singer Kiki Palmer is Chili. The superstar group also released a new soundtrack album called 20. As Chili stated, Little Mama may tour with TLC next year. Crazy Sexy Cool, the TLC story, pr premieres on VH1 on, on October 21st. The search for Kristen Gray begins. Over the weekend, Sons of Anarchy's Sons of Anarchy actor Charlie Hunnam announced that he will not be a part of the Fifty Shades of Grey film. Charlie's close sources stated, truly due to scheduling, the role of Kristen Grey, Kristen Grey requires a lot of commitment. Charlie is, Charlie is the lead of, the, of a massive TV series and his loyalty will always be to Sons of Anarchy family and friend, fans, end quote. So who, so who will replace Charlie Hunnam? Rumors spread, rumor spread it that it will be Robert Pattinson or Ian Somerhalder, but that has remained a mystery. The Glee cast said their final goodbyes to quarterback Finn Hudson. The Corey Monteith Trophy episode aired last Thursday night. It was an emotional as the cast came together and sung to the star that passed. The episode, however, did not include a funeral or even how Finn died. The, f the powerful episode presented the actors to do their best performance. Rachel Berry, played by Leah Michelle, appeared at the end singing a Bob Dylan rendition of Make You Feel My Love. Leah Michelle talked about the tribute and stated, I feel like for me personally, I've lost two people, Corey and Finn, end quote. Justin Bieber's spitting charges, spitting and speeding charges has dropped. It was reported that a neighbor of Bieber approached him and complained about making too much noise with his car speeding through the neighborhood. The LA County District Attorney dropped the charges as Bieber as, neighbor as the neighbor approached the star on his property without permission, and also added that there were no evidence that Justin had spit on him. As for the speeding charges, rapper Tyler, the creator, admitted to, admitted to speeding in Justin's car as he was on the motorcycle behind him. The pop star's charges, the pop star's charges dropped because there was simply no evidence. That's all I have for this week for entertainment. Let's send it back over to Joanne and James. Thanks, Leah. Now we're making some smoothies. And Joanne, didn't you say this was your great, great, great grandma Gertrude's favorite recipe? Yes. Yes, it was. Today we're making a breakfast smoothie. Mm. And it's actually really easy. I got, I found it under the campus vegan recipes on cooks.com. So. Not grandma Gertrude? No. <laughs> so we start with one cup of vanilla soy milk. Okay. And you pour it in the we'll, blender. We'll mime it for you guys. And then mm. you Mine. Get one banana, and then you cut it up so that it can blend easier. And so then we're going to cut the banana into pieces. And then after mm. we cut the whole banana up, we'll put it in the blender. And then you put 14 frozen strawberries. Since yeah. the strawberries are frozen, it'll make it thicker and more like a milkshake than it would. That's good. Like, so it's not runny and gross. And then you're going to add one half cup of oats, like not the quick cook ones. I love Because that oats. would be weird. And like the... They're just regular oats. They're called rolled oats. Mm -hmm. And then we're gonna add. Then we're gonna add um, one and a half teaspoons of sugar, and one and a half teaspoons of vanilla. Okay. So then we already blended it all up for you. Nice and pretty. And we have it in the blender. It's okay. like kind of a pink color, and it smells Beige. really good. Oh, that's gorgeous. Yeah, and it's like really filling, and it works really well no, for breakfast. No, this is healthy, right? Yeah, this is healthy. Everything about this is healthy. Well, that's good, because Quaker and Oats, it's vegan. Yeah, Quaker Oats are good for your heart. Silk is good for other things. Um, this is a good thing. Yeah, and it actually tastes really good. Yeah, and that's great. it's just really easy to make in the morning, and since you're not allowed to have like a micro, well, I don't know if you're allowed to have a microwave, but you're not allowed to have some stuff in your dorm rooms, but you can probably you have a you, blender. You you started eating this every morning, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's good. Quick, fresh, and refilling. Yep, and it's really good. And you can put other fruits in it, too. Like, you can put, like, blueberries. And mm. I like to freeze the bananas because it makes it thicker. And it tastes really good. Good. That's great. Um, well, Joanne, that was a quick, easy thing for us here on Daybreak. Join us right here next week for more entertainment, sports, weather, and news. Thanks for joining us, guys. See you later.
Thanks.